Richard Wynn, uh, MP for the local area. G'day, Richard. G'day, how, how are you going? You've just done the coin toss I for have. the game. I have. Uh, fantastic crowd here again at the at the spiritual home of the Magpies here at Victoria Park. And we're so pleased um, to be a part of today. Uh, the Victorian government, of course, is a is a principal sponsor of, uh, of this RecLink event, uh, along with the Responsible Gaming Foundation, which plays such an important role uh, in sending the message about responsible gambling. And it, we, we do know that it is a problem, uh, particularly for young people uh, who, who, are, who, are, who are basically uh, engaged often in sport but also in gambling as well. And that's why having Louise Glanville, a CEO here today, and I hope you get a chance to interview her, really sends a powerful message about uh, that gambling and sport uh, actually they don't, don't mix. They don't have to they be connected. They don't have to be connected at all. They don't have to be, yeah. <clears throat> and RecLink, of course, is a magnificent organisation. It does such in incredibly important work, not only here in Victoria, but it has a national profile. Uh, and people, I think, really respect the work uh, because uh, RecLink really reaches some of the most vulnerable people in our community. And that's why the state government is so pleased uh, to be a sponsor of today's event. You're, so, a, you're the member for Richmond, that's right. So yep. that's that's really the sports Do hub of Melbourne. you go for the Tigers? Well, yeah, it is the sports hub of Melbourne. Obviously, here I we are. I go for the Tigers. So you go for the Tigers? Yeah, so you go for the Tigers? Uh, no, actually, I go for the Kangaroos. What? But, but the Tigers are great people. I have a wonderful association with them. Oh, really? Uh, Do you know them personally? I know them. I know them very, very well. Their CEO, Brendan Gale. Do you know uh, Daniel Rioli? I don't, no, sadly I don't, but I, I I know their administration very, very well. They are. That's who I want to meet. I want to meet the admin people of the Tigers. I don't want to meet the players. Richard, Brendan Gale's a man. He, is, um, he was a great player back in the day Also as a well. great player as well. Terrific person. And uh, uh, I, I love Richmond. I do a lot of work with them. And they're just, they are great people. So you're going for the megahertz, though. Of course, I'm going for the and megahertz. But you did the coin toss. I did. So I didn't rig the the, the coin toss. Well, why not? <laughs> well, you had the best I had opportunity. The chance. I had the I had the chance. Uh, it's going to be a, it's going to be a tough game, and the scores at the moment where it's a draw at the moment. Uh, so we're about ten minutes into the first quarter. It is a high a quality Six game. Old. Frankly, I think we've got a full house here. We'll we'll get third, somewhere between 12 and 13,000 people this year. Last year was a lockout. We had 10,000 in, and 3,000 people couldn't actually get into the game. So we're really pleased with the outcome. It's so going to be a good fantastic one. day, and go megahertz! Thanks so much for joining us, Richard. Good on you. Thanks a lot. Thank you. Cheers.